The schedule page allows the user to configure the recording schedule of cameras, audio, and events. Cameras added into an exact system are scheduled to record motion by default, and events created are scheduled to occur 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. The schedule can be modified in one of two ways, by day or by source. While in the Days tab, the current day will be selected. To change a camera's schedule, highlight the squares corresponding to the hours across the top. The entire day for a camera can be selected by clicking the camera's name to the left. Once squares are highlighted, click on one of the recording types from the top of the page. Motion will record the camera only when set on motion. Free Run will continuously record and selecting None will turn off recording. You can also enable time lapse by specifying a value and then hours, minutes, or seconds from the adjacent drop down menu. Hitting the Apply button will make changes to the currently selected day. The same schedule can be copied to other days of the week using the Set function. Select the days to copy to, click the Set button, and then click Apply. Similarly, audio and events can also be scheduled through the Days tab. Audio is listed beneath the camera and can be either scheduled off or with free run. Events are scheduled to occur continuously unless specified as none. Alternatively, the schedule can be modified using the Sources tab at the top. This allows the user to schedule by individual cameras, audio, or events as opposed to days of the week. Select a source from the left hand side to pull up that source's weekly schedule. As before, click the squares or the days of the week to the left to highlight the schedule. Clicking the record setting and clicking apply will apply that change to the source's weekly schedule. The apply to button can also be used to apply the same schedule to multiple sources, similar to the set function on the days tab. Note that changes made in sources will be reflected in days and vice versa.